Boom, what up, Solo Renekton only here back doing some more League of Legends action, playing against this goofball in the top lane. Wham. Uh, he's gonna be really aggro in the early game here. He's gonna try and, oh, never mind, he doesn't have Ignite. I can play way more aggro. Sweet! But yeah, we're doing a Glacial Augment uh, Kale build. We're just gonna be a little cautious about him early. Like I said, they always try and stack up. Actually, he might just let me push. If he gives me control of the lane, I'm just gonna AFK shove him in. That's the way to go here, I think. Alright. Sweet! But yeah, we're playing Glacial Augment Kale, so it's gonna be like a relatively standard build, but the runes are gonna be different. Now, this is the Glacial Augment shining right there. As they try and kite away from you, you just walk up and pelt them. And they get slowed by, uh, what, 35%? Or it scales to 35% and starts at 30 it's a little bit less on a range champion compared to a melee, but still very good. Pop that bone plating. Sweet. Give me a hit. Nope. And just keep him zoned, though. Oh, dude, I should have should just queued it. Thought I was going to be in range to auto attack it in time. Alright, he's going to be sitting back here. Sweet. Perfecto. So yeah, Nastra's 2 with Rage Blade. That's what we're going to be building here. Uh, with obviously boot upgrade early as well. Whew. I need to not Q early. I have to stack... I, I have to not stack my uh, abilities. Or my slows, rather. Uh, we, we should kill this guy 100%. Pop bone plating again. It's gonna give us a big opening. I mean, he's so low. We just dive this guy. I tank here. Woo. All right, sweet. I want to tank because if I don't tank, this guy's gonna get one hit by a minion base or by the tower basically. So I have to kind of tank for him. Uh, I'm gonna sit here. I probably should have helped him do this, huh? Heal him up. Oh, baby. Let's go. Big place. We're gonna leave. Good shit, brother. Good shit. Whew. Hopefully my heal comes up. Oh, he should just leave. He doesn't have anything up. Nice! Alright. Good place. <laughs> Generally, you want to be a little bit careful in the early game. Because you do, you do decent damage, but... It's only in that scenario where people are like running away from you after a trade. So you try and survive the trade without taking too much damage and then answer with the Glacial Augment slow. And again, I fucked up my Q slow again. I'm stacking them both, which is not good. Again, you want to hit first. It's a little weird because normally with Kayla, you'd Q because that'd be your slow and then you'd auto with the Q, right? But this you want to auto first because you're going to apply Glacial Augment. And then once the Glacial Augment ends, right? So it's a two second slow. Once that ends, then you Q slow them after. That's how you got to do it. Ooh, that hit. Get wrecked. I got red buff right now, so... <laughs> so I can just keep autoing him. Ooh, shit. No! Alright, sweet. Pop potion. Get a ward in this bush. Looking good. No! I was trying to pop bone plating. Oh, what is he building? He's building armor. What? That's not what you want to do. I'm shredding your magic resist, my friend. Uh, <laughs> I think he's going to have a little bit of trouble here. I got my ult up, so I want to be aggro. Let's be a little careful here. Ah, I could have hit him there. Oh, be careful there, buddy. Whew. I might get ganked here soon. Alright. Uh, not too bad. Not too bad at all. Alright. He's got to pop another potion there. Pressured him under. We can probably make a play here with my ult. He's got ult too, so I gotta be careful. His all in definitely kills me if I don't ult most of the damage. I have to block the burst. 
Yo, soggy balls. Thanks for the hundred biddies, my friend. Appreciate that, dude. <laughs> Yo, tricks. Thanks for the sub, man. Welcome to the crocodile crew. Yo, Enzo. Welcome back, bud. Two months. Yeah, unfortunately, got spotted by Pink Ward. Yo, True North Koala. Appreciate the. Oh boy. Appreciate the sub, my man. Bad potion. Uh, we can do this. If you can get over that wall. We definitely dive him. Don't type to him, Mike. Don't type. Just forget about it. <laughs> ah! Oh my god, dude. Are you kidding? He E's and doesn't right click the guy to kill him. What the fuck? I should have walked away after one more tower shot, but oh my god. Are you kidding me, dude? I got executed, so I didn't give away gold. I just gave away time, basically. Oh, man. All he had to do is... <laughs> Jesus. All he had to do is auto attack the guy. He pressed E, the guy went the other way with Q, and he just, like, his mind fizzled. He didn't know what to do. <laughs> Holy moly. Alright, let's get aggressive on this tower and start pushing like crazy. We got our items here. Boot 2 rush is really good because you get extra movement speed, which is obviously very beneficial. Alright, he's gonna come top. He's level 5, though. I think I want to clear the wave. And... Establish some vision control. Oh my nipples. Good lad, man. This guy's right over here for sure. Let's pop potion. Try to find him. He might be at blue. Ooh, if he's not doing that, he's gotta be at blue, right? Oh, okay. Never mind. He was just all the way over here doing it. That makes more sense. Okay. Tabby Rush. Interesting. Whew! That damage, baby. That's what I'm telling you. It's all about that reply damage. I'm gonna take heal second. I would get more damage. Cool. You're gonna get spotted by the uh oh never mind. If he hugs that wall, he should be fine. What? Dude. This guy's getting bodied in mid lane. I should have not flashed and I should have Zhonya's. I think we just wait and then go under. That a boy. I could have started that hit too. I still have Zhonya's up. I think we're okay. I think we're actually okay here. Yeah, there's no way he does anything. <laughs> like, what do you mean? <laughs> this guy's like almost full HP. Oh yeah, doesn't he regen? Yeah, 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 I remember this. My chat told me. He like regens when he's in that stealth form. So he got like a shitload of health back. I healed him as well. And then I'm never dying there because I have Zhonya's. We could have made that dive better though. That was kind of sloppy. That was very sloppy. Alright. Damn. I'm just gonna go farm this real quick. I'll get 150 gold. So wait! That was really awkward though. It's gonna take a year! I have so much gold to spend. I'll have my Nash's tooth once I buy. Which is massive. Yo, William, what up? Welcome to the Crocodile Crew, bud. Appreciate it. 
Much love, man. At least this mid tower is almost done. Or almost taken. I can go mid and maybe pressure it. Did this guy leave on a slow pushing top wave to like check a camp that's already done? Oof. What this ended up costing him is me teleporting, because now this wave catches. Whereas if he hard shoved the wave, it'd be under tower, and I'd be forced to TP to get all those minions. All this whole wave should be under tower right now. But he like back to go do something else. I don't really know what he was doing. Because this camp was down. And we didn't leave any minions, so he didn't even clear smalls. I think he went to like check the camp. Maybe he thought I was gonna like stay around, but it'd be really dumb. You wanna check items in that scenario. Like I obviously can't stay around with no items. Oh dude, never mind. I don't even have teleport up. Scratch everything I just said. <laughs> All right. If I had teleport up, but let's be real, he doesn't know that I don't have it. Alright, let's roll. I wanna get deep a vision in their jungle. Beautiful. Uh, let's go here. I just want vision control in the jungle. I mean, this guy can like push mid together. Ooh. Uh, they're getting surrounded. Yeah, hey, we gotta go over here. Teemo's coming too, that's why. Oh boy. How did I hit that, dude? How did I hit that? Oh, I had ult. Yep. Uh, here, I'll ping it so he knows. <laughs> Is that VM? Damn. That guy's getting melted. Can I catch? I have speed up a W. Alright. Not that fast. We'll be okay. I can just heal up. I have both potions ticking. Perfect. Alright, we're back and going for Rage Blade next. Attack speed component is fine with me. Uh, let's sell this. Grab this. Sweet. Heal up. Dragon. I go top lane. I got TP. Perfect. Perfecto. <laughs> Toxic. Super toxic. Uh, this wave's gonna slow push to me. Beautiful. Let's go get that wave. How much movement speed do I get with that W? Oh god, I'm so fast. How long does it last? Three seconds. Holy moly. It's got a ratio. It's pretty good too. The champ just scales so hard. Just wait till I get my rage lid. I mean, it's already starting to look ridiculous, but when I have my rage blade, it's like. <laughs> Even more, even more ridiculous. And when I have my rage blade, I'll actually be able to kill cannon minions. Not yet, but once I get those, once I get that rage blade, we'll have enough damage potentially to take down the elusive cannon minion, brother. Are you serious? Get out of here with that garbage. See, this is where I'm supposed to queue him, but he had too much distance away from me. Hmm. The main reason I figured he was there is because I see no one on bot side. Oh, that's gonna catch. Q. Not all ending there. I'm gonna lose my slow. His whole team's coming. Bloop, bloop. Goodbye. All right, easy peasy. Easy peasy. We just look at the map. We see no one fighting my team. My team's like invading their bot side jungle. No one's over there fighting them, contesting them, envision of them. What does that mean? They're probably all over here somewhere. It's either they're all hiding in their base or they're all sneaking up on me. So we wait for my team to pressure other stuff to force them to show. Brother, you ain't doing shit. Come on. Cut it out. Cut it out. Oh, what? You just nuke Hecarim? Dude, one day I'll get a cannon minion. I promise you. I promise! Not even close, baby. Not even close, baby. That was actually really funny. I went to ult him, and then he ulted, so I couldn't target him, and it immediately self-ulted me, and I pulled tower aggro. <laughs> it was like the perfect scenario. It's like, oh, okay, well. Yeah, that's exactly what I meant to do. 
He just stole my whole wave. I already have enough trouble, brother. We definitely want to take in hibs if we can. Just gotta be careful not to int. Don't do that. Don't throw for no over. No, 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 no. Don't throw. Don't throw. No, no, no. Just back. Just back. Just back. Don't hit! Oh, my God, dude. Team out. Flash, Q, ignite. Oh, my God. Poor guy. He calculated it, dude. Even through the heal, he still had it. Damn. What a legend. What an absolute legend. All right. We got a Rage Blade. We're looking good. We're looking good. Holy moly. <laughs> Just wait till you see this damage. Uh -oh. uh, I mean, I can TP here. I just don't really think I can catch both of those people. They're very fast. Like, I'm fast too, but... <laughs> Look at this shit, dude. I love it. Whew! Let's get in the side lane, baby. I still have my uh, stopwatch here, so we're doing pretty good. Yo, Fat Albert, thanks for the two months, dog. Appreciate it. Welcome back. Two months and counting. Keep up the good work. Yo, will do, my man. Welcome back. All right. Team should set this up. I want to get in the side lane and split push. I'm very, very strong in the 1v1 scenario. That's pretty much what you want to do with Kale. You want to farm up the early game best as you can. If you get good matchups, though, like this one, seems to be a decent matchup. If this guy went Ignite and, like, tried to all-in constantly, it does not seem like fun. I just played against an Aurelia. That did that, and it was not a fun matchup. But if they go slow and they don't like really force all ins with the ignite constantly, it's pretty easy to outplay them. Oh, I got a bail. Ooh, the boy's in trouble here. Ooh! Holy shit, I'm so fast, dude. What the hell? <laughs> what? Dude, I'm so fast. Outrun. It's that W movement speed, dude. And now we're full health again. Wow, this is actually annoying to deal with, huh? Oh, I got outplayed. I got outplayed. Baited and outsmarted so hard! Oh! No! Alright, you fucks. You did it to me. Dude, I literally just saw Tima walk out of fog. Or out of vision into fog. I'm like, all right, let's go back to base. And this guy's like backing in front of me like, oh, I got a free kill here. <laughs> uh, I'm like, please team, don't die for no reason and feed back a huge shutdown. Meanwhile, how much gold did I just give back there? 800 gold I just gave to the team out. This is why it's so important not to die when you have a lead. And it's not even just the gold, it's the EXP. Like I'm, a, I'm levels ahead of these people. That guy was level 11. He probably got so much EXP off of me dying right there. Like, ugh. Yikes. No bueno. Alright, let's go Lich Man here. I'm gonna TP up. I can come here and help you. Oh. Dude, I am melting that guy. Watch this shit. Beep beep. <laughs> I do so much damage. Holy shit. Come here, little Tito. You're next, buddy. Come here, Tito! Oh. Tito thinking about it. As long as he doesn't blind me, we're good. Okay, he blinded me. Oh. Oh my god, I melted him. One second! No! Oh. Yeah, I could have done it, man. He blinded me at the same time the guy knocked me back with E. And he has... This guy has no ultimate. I could have killed both of them in that... Oh, are you kidding me? Alright, alright, alright. You win this time. But I will win the next time. Oh! That ult damage, though. Teemo can't do shit. Oh, man. I had that, dude. Right, comeback mechanics are fun. I mean, yeah, I don't know. I, I think it's a good mechanic. I don't know if it should be as extreme as it is, but I think it's a good mechanic. 
Like, you need... Dude, if you kill a guy who's, like... There's a 10-0 and 0 dude on their team with a 3-level advantage. If I kill... That's a fucking raid boss right there. If I kill that guy, I better get extra gold. I better get extra EXP. Like, you're... You have to make... It is very difficult for, like, you to beat someone who's that far ahead, right? You need to either outnumber them, have, like, three against one, two against one, whatever. Even, you know, maybe not even two against one if they're that fed that they have a big shutdown. But... I don't know. I like I like gold shutdowns. I think they're they are good for the game. I just don't know how high you want to go with the amount because I've I've given back you know right there I gave back an eight hundred gold shutdown. I had six kills at the time. Like what? It's a bit ridiculous. A bit ridiculous. But so is this champion. Whew! Let's go, baby. I mean, this game is just gonna get worse and worse for them because in reality, I'm just hitting my power spike. When you get the two items, this and this, with your boot upgrade, obviously. This is the power spike. We get our Nasher's Tooth. That's 50% attack speed, 80 uh, ability power, and then 20% CDR plus the on-hit damage, right? And then this is amplifying that on-hit damage, amplifying everything pretty much. And it's scaling off of all this, scaling off of our E, scaling off of our attack speed. Beautiful. And then obviously we go Lich Bane there, so we get that big damage burst as well. I mean, you can go more on-hit action if you want, but Lich Bane, Death Cap is kind of where, I'm, where I was headed. Or you can go Lich Bane, like Zhonya's, that's fine as well. But yeah. Pretty good game. This champion kind of seems very, very good. In melee matchups, just because, I mean, I was fucking it up constantly because I didn't really think about it before the game started. But the way you want to do it, like I said, is you turn your E on, right, in auto attack. So you get that glacial augment for two seconds. It's got a four second cooldown. So you get, well, four to seven, it scales with the game. So as you level up, it goes down to four second. But yeah, so you get a two second slow with your Q or whatever Q is, 1.5 seconds, two seconds, whatever. Or you get two seconds with the glacial augment and then you use your Q after. Because you can't, like, stop the glacial augment. It's going to happen on that first auto attack every time because it's off cooldown, right? But you can't control when you use your Q. So glacial augment, use your W to move in speed uh, toward them. Use your Q to slow after the glacial augment ends. And then you got, like, a 1 to 0.5 second, or you got, like, a 2 second window that, like, scales down as the game goes. And it gets to the point where you can auto attack, Q, auto attack, and they're slowed for, like, 7 seconds, which is kind of ridiculous. Anyways, GG Well Played. Hope you guys enjoyed that one. If you're watching over on Twitch right now, make sure to follow the stream and uh, subscribe to the channel if you have a free sub available with the Twitch Prime. If you're watching over on YouTube right now, make sure to subscribe to the channel, drop a like on the video, and turn your notification bell on. That's it for me. GG Well Played. Hope you guys enjoyed that one. Make sure to tune in next time. Peace!